Hello everyone. Today we eat at Eco Botany Kang Bi Hong Rose Meat Restaurant located at this address. In today's video, I'm going to show you this Chinese restaurant as well as two highly rated cafes in this area. So let's go. Echo Botany is a place not many Singaporeans are aware of. It's a shame as there are so many good restaurants and cafes in this neighborhood. You could eat here every day for a week and not repeat the same thing once. Okay, some dim sum. Sure. Yeah. Ice Yuan Yang, eight ringgit fifty cents. Yuan Yang is a drink created by mixing coffee with tea. It originated in Hong Kong but very popular in Singapore and Malaysia too. This one is not wonton. This one is sweet cow. Fresh stream wonton soup, eleven ringgit ninety cents. Seven pieces of wonton for eleven ringgit ninety cents only. This is a dish with great value. Thai style double mixed crispy tofu, fourteen ringgit ninety cents. Classic Thai style fried tofu. The tofu is very beautifully fried. It is very crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. Shredded chicken dumpling mee soup, thirteen ringgit ninety cents. They give a very generous amount of shredded chicken. The dumplings are also full of fillings with awesome shapes. Then why you say the? Very delicious. It's very near Singapore. Traditional white coffee, four ringgit ninety cents. The white coffee has a very thick layer of foam on top for extra texture. Now let me try it myself. I'm gonna stir it even more for a fuller flavor. It is sweet and heartwarming. I'm not going to waste any drops. It is done. Now I'm ready to go tackle the cafes. Let's go. Seven Oaks. Bakery Cafe located at this address. There are quite a number of these cafe all over JB. Each of them has their own unique decoration, so it is always full of surprises to visit a new one. Seven Oaks specializes in croissant and modern fusion brunch. Their name has existed in JB for more than seven years already. As usual, cafe in JB is much more spacious than the ones in Singapore. I really hate to sit shoulder to shoulder with other customers when I'm spending my time in the cafe. Wow! Thank you. Seven Oaks Mocha, eleven ringgit. The mocha comes with a tiny piece of oat cracker. 
I'm just going to enjoy it by dipping it in the beverage. Seriously, I have no idea how I'm supposed to eat it. Very crunchy. Eleven ringgit for this big cup of mocha is well worth your money. Chocolate raspberry mousse, twenty ringgit. I know this costs twenty ringgit, but there is gold powder on the leaf. Doesn't it look fancy? Okay, let's check out the mousse. Mousse is a soft prepared food that incorporates air bubbles to give it a light and airy texture. I just googled that. The chocolate inside is very thick. It just fill your whole mouth with cocoa smell when you eat it. I am not really a dessert person. But I quite like the special sensation this mousse provides to my taste bud. You can see how dense it is from the side. What a nice tea time meal! You should come and try when you are here. Now let me bring you to another cafe that I was talking about. Tom and Danny Coffee, located at this address. This cafe is two story. The whole shop is very brightly lit. Very good if you like to take photos. After climbing the cement staircase, you will reach the second floor. The design has changed to a more living room style. These are the bar seats, except there are no bars in front of you. The bar is located directly below you instead. Good for people who likes to observe. Rose chocolate and apple mojito. It's like rose. I have no idea what this rose chocolate is about. The chocolate taste is strong with a hint of rose flavor. Is this biodegradable straw? The smell not nice, but the taste is nice. I like the clear liquid and the nice color combination of all the ingredients in it. My kid is here. I just want to drink. It's a very fancy sweet and sour beverage, and I like it. This one worth the money. Hokkaido meal crab. Nice, eh? To be honest, this crab really looks very pretty to me. With the flower petals on top, it looks so well crafted. Oh wow! So creamy. <laughs> I guess the Hokkaido in the name means it is using Hokkaido milk. Hokkaido milk is said to be free of any added processed ingredients, has a mild, almost vanilla-like flavor, and a rich taste that coats the taste buds. The strong milk smell just bursts inside my mouth. This is unbelievably tasty. Please give this video a like if you want to try the crab too. Also subscribe. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.